it's really going out and and striving to actually make do make yourself better, make your make things better for your for your family, make environment better. It's actually just improving improving things in in and around yourself. So on that definition are you ambitious? Oh, probably. Probably? Yeah, I'd say yes. Yeah, why do you think you're that way? Oh, I don't know. It's probably from my upbringing. Um, my parents taught us that um, if you work hard and you can you can achieve your goals, your dreams, um, and never let people tell you you can't. Um, but yeah, work hard, play fair. If I asked you to describe the most ambitious person that you know, what would pop into your head? Ray Avery. Mm -hmm. why, why Ray? Um, he started with nothing. Um, and he really had no means. He created his own means. He, he took it. All his opportunities. He um, had a vision of what he wanted to do, and and he just didn't let things get in his way, and and um, just kept pushing forward, and and ma always made the best of any situation he was in. He's he's quite an inspiring character. Probably I'm a little bit conservative, um, if if and and risk adverse. Um, if I wasn't, yeah, I'd probably be more ambitious than, than I am, um, but having said that, I, I'm pretty happy with where we're up to as a, as a family and, and what we do. One of the projects we're doing is, is um, working with um, home economics teachers, HETANs, and working with the Heart Foundation and the Health Promotion Agency and putting together curriculum for uh, cooking in intermediate schools. Um, year eight resources are already done and they're starting to go out in the classroom and it's been absolutely awesome in the last two or three months to see kids picking that up and using real resources where, where they learn, learn a lot about vegetables and um, at the end of the day they'll be able to cook and look after themselves. At the moment we're having a big discussion in New Zealand uh, about legalising marijuana and um, that's probably the from what I see in our local community here where it's quite its use is quite endemic it steals ambition um, most of the people I know that uh, and, and many of the employees that I've employed over the last 20 years that have um, alcohol and drug related issues they just end up sitting in a hole and, and working only for today and never thinking about tomorrow, never thinking about how to improve their lot, how to improve themselves, um, how to improve things for their family. And um, yeah, it's quite sad. Um, so, although this is not about mar no. marijuana, it's, it's, um, it, it's that, that lack of mana, self-esteem, ambition, personal ambition. Um, you, you see it a lot in some of our communities um, and as an employer you, you see it and I've seen it in quite a few of our seasonal staff and that's really quite disappointing over time they lack that self self worth and um, yeah it's lack of ambition is quite corrosive